Hello everyone, welcome to Hot Lava, game by Clay, who I'm trying to... Oh, there we go. Clay brought us Oxen Not Included and Don't Starve. Good games like that are also my favourite one, which is Invisible Ink. That was a good one too. And this is the new beta, which was quietly released apparently during E3. Uh, I'm currently playing with a controller, but I'm not sure whether it's best to do so. But this is called Hot Lava, and it's already got that clay style to it, which I'm very appreciative of. Whoa! Um, I've already played it a couple of times. I say played it a couple of times. I've started this episode a couple of times already. Oh, oh! A couple of times already because I want to make sure that I know what I'm doing. And I almost know what I'm doing. Um, there is... This is the intro. This is completely the intro. There is a little... Um, you call it a, 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 like a cartoon going on up there. We just saw it playing on the TV, but you can watch that entire cartoon yourself. Gives you a little bit of random story to the game. Why is there a kitchen upstairs? And I'm going to have to change the sensitivity of this, I am afraid. The other trouble is, the it's very beta, so look at the uh, controls here. It's quite difficult to sort of understand what's happening. <laughs> no idea what to do there. Looking for... There we go. So, no, this one. There we go. It's very slow. Oh, 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 I pressed a button and I didn't mean to. Settings. <laughs> uh, you can, you can, it feels beta E. Because this is a very slow progress right here. I don't even know if that's a decent number right now, so. Uh, resume, I guess. That uh, feels a bit better. Uh, I'm playing with a controller, but it doesn't seem to be too well supported right now, but it also feels a lot better to play it with a controller. Oh, there's the bad guy that we saw from the thing. Can I grab this? What does this do? Speed boost? Don't know. Jumped on it though. Happy with that. I guess we want to follow this guy. Ah! If you, it says in the introduction that if you jump again after jumping for the first time, you will maintain momentum. This is a strange game. <laughs> I think I am in the mind of some child who believes that he is playing against the antagonist from the cartoon that he was watching at the time. I mean, I've made it to bed now. I fell! Oh, what's that? Let's go over there. Can we go over there? Yes, I bet we can grab onto this. Oh, grab ledge. Hmm. Huh. And, whoa, whoa. That dude got me. Got me good. This is hot lava. Ah. See, the last time I did this, I pressed play, and then, you know, here are some things. So I press play, and then... This seems to be online, which is the interesting thing. Also, I don't... Oh, okay, so that was right bumper. Seems to have accepted that thing. And the gym bell's gone, but I'm kind of expecting this to suddenly turn to lava, but this did not turn to lava, so... Where am I going? Over there somewhere? I like that it has a little... Um, I mean, I can just walk on the ground right now. Isn't that silly? Isn't that veered? Uh, I don't really know where I'm going. I don't know what this thing below me looks like. Wherever you want, run jumps. Okay. Oh, someone else has found lava. Uh, I, I locked up. Hello? Ooh, I'm back. There we go. Huh. I'd love a gym like this. How'd you, how'd you get away with this being a gym? How much money do you have in your country? Oh, you have to get into it. <laughs> cool. I love the way this looks already. It's a really well-developed beta in terms of gameplay, at least, as far as I can tell. Um, and it seems to be like a time trial sort of thing. So I'm going to fail already. There we go. It's almost like the new Tony Hawk. <laughs> you know, it's very fast-paced. Try and again. Improve yourself as many times as you can. What did that do? Jump to grab ropes and pipes. Right on. I think that's just like a, a waypoint, and then you get teleported to the next area. Jump or crouch to let go of the pipe. Which is, which one? Hold forward when jumping to launch forward. Jump this way. Oh, come on. Oops. Oh, oh. This is an interesting game for being third person. First person. It would be less interesting if it were third person. You can make it third person, I think. You can hold down a third-person button, but it doesn't stay there long. 
Ah! Swing me forward and back. Gotcha. I can do that. I tried to maintain my momentum, but... Oh, didn't swing far enough. Tried to maintain my momentum, but I walked into the thing instead of having any momentum. <laughs> tried to land on top of it. What is this, Prince of Persia? What was that? I pressed this, and it gave me... Hazard too far away. I don't know what that does. Okay. Uh, I mean, this has been easy so far, although I have... Steer around obstacles in the air by looking where you want to go. Ah! Listen, let me grab the edge, bro. That's interesting mechanic. I'm not sure if I have the speed. Oh, we do. S little bit of air control. Okie dokie. Ah, uh, this is really hard now. I spoke too soon, didn't I? What did, what did land land on there? It looks like every now and then you get a little bit of relief from a, a rock in the lava that doesn't actually hurt you. Boom. Oh, put it as sticky. Use it to jump off walls. Oh, fancy. You can slide a short distance when stuck to a wall. Huh. This is like children playing Prince of Persia. I love it. And I mean the new Prince of Persia, which is not that new. I mean, I was probably playing it in like 2009, which means it was already... What did I What did I win there? Is that like a waypoint for timing purposes? Oh, what is happening? Oh! <laughs> I can imagine this can be quite the interesting game. Turns out you can jump on top of those. Oh, dude, bro. Dude, bro. Grab it, dude, bro. I like that I can see myself, but also I feel like that's going to be a little bit obnoxious at some point in the future. I can see how this game would be very satisfying, which is why I called it the um, the new Tony Hawk. Because if you can get through something like that in a decent amount of time, or collect some secrets on the way or something like that. Beta Series 1 contains a spectacular variety of beta items. Yes. Oh, it's got dailies and stuff. This is, I mean, I've been playing Quake and it's got the same sort of infection of, of you know, here's, here's how good you are and don't forget to play every day. Uh, I don't know if, what did that do? <laughs> it's kind of very difficult to control it to get to these things at the bottom. You see where it says exit here. That's kind of easy because it's part of this menu, but um, actually knowing how to deal with the menu. I'm assuming that the other menu item is a uh, is the other bumper, but it's not working. Okay, I opened those pretty quickly. Cactus, common. Lance, common. I don't replace. Hazard can't use this amazing moustache. Excuse me. Okay, I put I put these on. See I can't figure out how to use this. Start, select a oh See, now I've lost that thing. What did I just have? Toy shelf. Is that this? I need three five stars to unlock presumably the next person. New items. There we go. I can't control this menu. I'm going to use the mouse. If I, Luckily, if, it, if you click, it just changes for you. It's really good at switching between controls, which I think is really helpful because if I ever get stuck on a menu, I'm going to need that. Uh, I have no idea what these are. What is this? Okay, I'm going to carry that. It doesn't really tell me what is happening. Maybe it just customises my look. I'm okay with that as well. Let's go back. Uh, um, play something else. I, feel, uh, I didn't do too well on this one. Should we try it again or should we do the school? Let's play the school. Uh, and see if I can... See if I point at that and then press A. Nope, so it doesn't work. <laughs> Brilliant. Still in beta. It's an early beta as well, I think. So don't be too saddened by it. I expect there's going to be a lot of re-releases of this game. Uh, use your mouse to steer yourself in the air. I think they expect you to use um I think they expect you to use the mouse and keyboard, which I might do next go because the controller's been mighty pesky right now. I collected some stuff. Boing boing. Well, kind of assumed that I was gonna grab onto that, but maybe not. There's a lot of collectibles here actually. This is a bit of a Tony Hawk part. What is that? Security lock. Requirements. Middle school mischief. What? Hey. Oh. Oh. I made it and I didn't expect to. 
That confused me. I'll oh, come back. No! Mom! This game's mean. Can I run? Am I already running? Why am I so tiny? Look at this huge bin! What is happening? Open this door immediately. Don't you know who I am? Oh? I guess we'll just go this way then. <laughs> Sex unlocked. Requirements. You need to be better. He's telling me I'm not good enough. Ah, I see. This school has multiple places. Yes. Okay, let's just begin. I can imagine myself trying this over and over again, trying to get any good at it at all. Which I'm not. <laughs> oh, I expected to start off in the... Mate, I was... <laughs> it just restarted me whilst I was still going. Nah. Nah. Yeah, this is... Wait, what? I can grab that. Ah, I see. Even though it's made of, you know, canvas and it's just hanging up by a couple of staples. It can support the weight of this extremely quick child dressed up as a, a hasman. Oh, dear. <laughs> this is how I am with Tony Hawk. Except in Tony Hawk, of course, you have to get the uh, hang of pressing up and then... Uh, sorry, you press start and then down, down. Or up, up. That's right. Start, up, up, and then... Oh, mate, the floor is lava, dude. Stop. Start, up, up, A, and then that'll get you to the restart level, Majigger. And then you can just try and make sure that you actually land your... Uh... Dude, bro. Actually land your manual as soon as you start the level, and then you can start the level with a point multiplier, and as a result... You want me to actually get over there somehow? It does say to. I don't know what these little hazard things are. It looks like I hurt myself, but there doesn't seem to be the concept of hurting yourself. I managed this at least. Give me this. Give me this. Yeah. Oh. Uh, that really slows you down that bit, doesn't it? It's my checkpoint, I guess. Oh, those are obstacles. I thought they were going to fall apart because they're balloons. They're balloons, bro. Balloons, bro. Uh, you what? Oh, I'm on there, you say. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we'll get the hang of this, don't you worry. I need to be up there. Oh. Pop. Nah. Onto the balloons. Are you cereal? Oh, they're trampolines. <gasps> no, miss. That was hard. Oh, there we go again. I keep expecting to be further back than I was, because I don't expect it to be this forgiving. Ah! It didn't... It grabbed and then immediately let go. I don't know if I did that. I had to remap all the controls, by the way. It starts off, like, with very strange set setup. Um, again, it doesn't really seem to be designed for the controller, although it does work, which is... gratifying, I have to say. Whoa, what? Oh. Give me this. Appreciate in these cards. I guess we jump on the bin first. That would be a good idea. If we could reach the bin. Because the first time I picked it up, I thought I was jumping, but it also kind of looked like I wasn't. And then it turns out I wasn't. I'm going to have to increase this sensitivity even more. Uh, which is very frustrating to do. Maybe I can just use the mouse temporarily. Put it up to here. There we go. And then this should let me use it. Whoa! Not that much! <laughs> At least, like I say, you can switch really quickly between these. So maybe like 120? I'll do. Between the two to, uh, to, to control styles, because... Yeah, that's about right. Uh, you want me to do what? Oh. Where am I going now? Just swing in. Onto here. Oh, I missed it! I figured out what to do a little bit too late. You can walk into these other people, by the way. Uh, special, special, pardon me. Mate. It's actually better to jump off there than it is to try again. Hoi! And boing! And it's not done it! What is happening? Where are you going? It's clear that you have to do this and then... Yeah, so just fall in. In real life, by the way, you don't tend to get teleported to the vending machine that you were standing on. If you fall into the lava, you have to sort of re reacquaint yourself with the level. Is this correct? Am I doing this correctly? Should I swing a bit more? Hoist! And press A at the right time. There we go. He's done it. What a legend. 
No one can beat me at this game. Ever. I'm really glad this showed up in my radar, actually. It's only because there's a, currently a clay... Um, like a... There's a... Whatchamacallit? Like a, 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 an offer on the scheme right now? Scheme. That famous... <laughs> that famous distribution platform, Scheme. Which is written in... Erlang. Come on now. I keep jumping too far there, which means I end up missing... Yeah, you can't jump onto that from that, so you have to jump on the bin. Which means you have to jump on... I don't like this bit. This bit's terrifying. You have to do this, like, air jump, which we did learn about in the previous level, but come on. Oh, I think I'm going to waste a lot of time on this game. <laughs> Just trying to get to be any good at it. Mm, probably going to... Oh, mate, really? I keep doing that mistake. Like I don't learn. I think this might actually be a mouse and keyboard game, even though it doesn't seem like it. Just hold on a second. Let me, let me try this. Space is... It's all the right keys. You can definitely f see... Even from the recording, how much of a difference it makes to use the correct control style. I'm no longer waiting for the time it takes the controller to pan my character. I have some control over the speed at which I uh, make these ooh, um, turns. That's really the big deal there. Do you think these other people are picking up my... Um, my cards? Because sometimes they're there and sometimes they're not. Thank you for the waypoint. It was a bit of an awkward game. I want to know if I can... Oh. See, what I did there was I thought I was better than the game. <laughs> the game does tell you that if you look in a different direction, you will, you know, go in that direction. And yet I thought I could just look over there and see what was happening. This, it's a little bit too quick when it respawns you, to be fair, because I haven't reacted to the fact that I failed. So... Right, these kids must be getting in a lot of trouble for this. This way? Yes. There we go. And then, like this? Yes. This is actually a lot easier than with the controller. Not to put any fuel onto the fire with a one true control scheme, but obviously this is it. I mean, I have been playing Quake recently. So I'm, I've become a pro again. Not that I ever wasn't. But, you know, mad, mad skills. Let's go over here. Go this way. Oh, oh, you can jump. Ah, okay, cool. Wow, a little bit of time to actually walk on the ground. Now what? This way? Ah, yes. Mate, you bounced off of something. <laughs> it just, just bounced off of the thing and thought it was cool about it. These kids. Which I assume I'm just playing some kid in his imagination, but what are you doing up here, child? This is very unsafe. I am trying to jump sideways, but I don't think that is the correct way of doing it. Quake style, you know. FPS style. The correct thing to do is jump forwards and then look around you. Just look around you. So you jump this way and then do that. There we go. Oh, he nearly did it. And look at this. That thing is teasing me. There's another kid. Get out of here, other kid. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know if I just stole his um, card, but karma got me. Karma got me in the end. I laughed at his misfortune, and I was summarily rewarded with my just desserts. So jump on here, and then... We can't do that. <laughs> that doesn't work. Hmm. This one's actually a puzzle. How did we get over there? He didn't do it right either. Mate, <laughs> he saw me do that. He's like, oh, he's going to miss that one again, isn't he? Yep. And he missed that one. I do assume that there's more momentum to the game than there is, because I'm used to games that have momentum. It's going to take a little bit of time to get used to the fact that if you look in a different direction... Oh. Don't know. <laughs> Found that, but I don't know what to do with it. Oh, yeah, dude's found it. I cleared him in, but he finished the puzzle. I did it wrong. 
Oh, I can... Oh. These waypoints are odd because, of course, then there are more waypoints and then that's okay anyway. Restart. It's much easier to restart in this game. Just jump. Land in the lava. I mean, I don't really want to... You have to use the A and D buttons to... Oh, come on. To move along a pipe but you'll still jump in the direction that you're looking if you press W and jump. Which is slightly... I think that's something that I would leave feedback to change. Because I don't want to do this, and then... If I jump... So what happened there was, I was that was that was for sciencing that, and I promise you that that was true. If you press uh, jump and then a direction, well in that case I got lucky. Oop. I presume I hit my head. I think that's what those hazard bars mean. You need to hit your head. If you press W, it, you'll jump in the direction you're looking. Since you're already pressing D, it kind of makes you feel like you'll be like jumping in the D direction, you know? Jump off. I can't! <laughs> How do you jump off of the thing? Oh, hello. I want to just drop. It feels like it could be satisfying, but there's a certain... It needs tweaking. See, because what I really wanted to do there was press the button at the right time. That was not an unsatisfying moment, except for the fact that I did it wrong. But we could do with some tweakage, just to... There we go! Right? Oh, mate. It, it's almost satisfying. There's a little ways to go. And most of it is, how the heck do you, ju oh, how the heck do you jump off of a pipe without jumping backwards? I'm pretty sure that was mentioned in the tutorial, but I do not remember it, so... Well, to be fair, in the tutorial, there was a ledge and I couldn't grab it. <laughs> right click. Shift. Con oh, control! Ah, ha ha It was control all along. Oh, and I died immediately. Yeah, so W in a direction is... Ooh, what did I win? Is jump in that direction, whereas you're already pressing not W, so... <laughs> I appreciate the fluidity of the respawn, but it'd be nice if it gave you a little bit of time to stop pressing the button you were already pressing. Who has been around this school making this course? Unless this is literally what's happening. And this is not this kid's imagination. Why are you going backwards, dude? I don't understand the purpose of it being online except to, you know, make it harder for me to get cards because other people keep nicking them. Can I get it there? No? Alright, look around. Look around you. Just look around you. Ah! Actually harder than it looks, this game. I don't think it's harder than it looks. I think this game is exactly as hard as it looks like it is. How does this kid have this in-air agility? I mean, oh, I guess he is a kid. You know, they're basically infallible. Not infallible in the... Knowledge way, obviously. Pretty impossible to injure in any respect. Even if they're jumping around on lockers. See, I wanted to sort of not have any momentum there. I want to bounce higher and higher and higher and... None of that was correct. How do I get... There's no putty on this wall. Or I would say it was that. Do I have to jump on this? Ah, maybe I have to jump on that. I don't know what the uh, thing in the middle is telling me. Oh, oh, oh. Who are you? I thought that was me. I thought I just lost my... Is this sort of a versus match? Did I break that for the person after me? <laughs> this is what a gym should be. Who's this dude? Are you lagged out? I mean, I thought I could jump off that wall, but apparently not. Can I just bounce and then grab that? Wow, I actually just completely ignored that vault. Well, man. Uh, I hate when people do that, it goes right through me. <laughs> Keep going, bro. I don't know what to do. Just fall in the lava, that's okay. 
This is so much easier with the mouse and keyboard. You're not even... I mean... <laughs> by my performance, you may disagree. But... Just based on the fact that I can actually try silly things. Because the control scheme doesn't seem to get in my way. Figured it out! Mum, look at me! If only you could use the floor once in a while, huh? This is an amazing gym, by the way. Considering it's in a school. You know? I don't know what this plus 0 0.07 thing is that's going on. Uh, oh, this way. This is great. I love the fact it's literally just kids playing the floor is lava, and yet I am one of those kids. Oh, I want that. Go back and get it. I can't fall off this pipe. This kid's amazing. Oh! Fell off the pipe. <laughs> kid's not so amazing. <laughs> Oh yeah, you can't strafe jump. Do you ever get the hang of strafe jumping in Quake? Anyone who played it? I mean, it wasn't Quake, it was Quake 2. There was a bit on uh, DM the Edge, which we all know and love, where you had to strafe jump from... What are you doing, mate? <laughs> I guess if you go AFK, it starts doing that for you. It's like in Commander Keen, where he sits down and reads a book. There was this bit where you could go from... Uh, just be more careful there. Wait. From one set of boxes to another. There's like a, a rocket launcher or the... Is there a BFG in that level? I don't think so. I think it was just a rocket launcher. Um, you could either rocket jump to it, which I think was what you're supposed to do. Or you could strafe jump to it. Which is what someone tried to teach me to do. And I got it exact I got it right exactly once, so it's not like it was a fib. And I've watched people doing it, you know. Huh. Huh. These kids have been learning parkour at their local school, which is just outrageous because we hadn't even heard of parkour when I was at school. Oh uh, mate. Oh. Nah, just fall in. Yeah, restart that. Wasn't worth. Hey. Wasn't worth doing it. No! Rawr, rawr, rawr. I hope that I don't get... Ca yeah. It does remember your like latest progress rather than bringing you back to sort of say here because it was the last thing you touched. That would be mean, wouldn't it? I'm supposed to grab the thing above you, mate. If you, <laughs> if you don't mind. I was kind of hoping that you would actually... Yeah, like that, except over there. Hoi! Done it again. Ended up in the wrong bit. This is a difficult bit. This is one of those less satisfying parts that I was mentioning before. And don't forget, it's not like I'm criticising the game for being not very well polished in an early beta that I didn't even pay for. But, you know, they, they release it for criticism. And that is my current criticism, is that there is a certain clunkiness, clumsiness to the progress of the game that means it's not quite as good as it could be. Hi! Control? Control? He's done it. Back of the net. That was probably not a very good performance, given that I, like, changed <laughs> control style halfway through and died a lot and intentionally jumped off a whole bunch. Uh, I earned Tsunami. Oh, I can play as somebody else. That's cool. I came first in a race of one people. Find the hidden Gat comic. It drew a line around it. I don't feel like I really deserve that. What is this? Good, good heavens. <laughs> There's a lot of things to do. Continue. Well, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna leave it there. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, I'm gonna keep playing. I might do another episode actually. But um, I hope this. I hope some of you might think of this as. Ooh. Wonder what this is. Uh, as a good introduction to the game, and some maybe an opportunity to uh, have a look at it yourselves. Because I, I think it's got a lot of potential. It's like I keep liking it to Tony Hawk, and it really is one of those sort of arcadey style, you know, just just go for it sort of games. I don't know what these are for. Um, see how much better I am now. Oh yeah, he's the best. Go, give me that. Ah, so yeah, check it out for yourselves if you want to. It's like seven quid on Steam. This is not a sponsored video, obviously. Don't even need to say that because it's, who would 
who is even aware that I'm making videos in order to sponsor me for it? But I did get it for free because somebody else bought it and gave me the spare copy. Yes, yeah, right, you get two copies if you buy this beta. And it is, it's not, um, it's not buggy. I'll give it that much. It's not actually buggy. It's just, needs polish. Uh, and here's probably some in this bucket here. So I think they've got everything. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that if I do another one, you will join me for that. And I hope that you will give me some comments to let me know whether you want me to do that. But until then, I'll see you.